Hey everyone, welcome to Pearls of Eden and I've got some current news that's gonna blow your socks off because it is crazy out here in these streets. 2024 is definitely starting us off with a lot of bangers, right? We first had the Cat Williams interview that broke the internet and exposed everybody for their filth. People are still trying to recover and sending in their receipts and their responses. But you know, like the old saying goes, only a hit dog hollers, right? So we know that Cat Williams was speaking a lot of truth and um, it's got everybody in their feelings, all right? And so then, did y'all hear about the judge, the judge that was giving her sentence and she got attacked. As she was giving the sentence, the man runs towards her, leaps over the desk. The desk is high, you all. He could be an Olympic athlete. Where did he get that tenacity that he was like, I'm I'm going, I'm going. out And y'all, he drugged the lady. It's pretty sad. The way he went after that lady, he... Whew. Just take a look. I just can't with that history. In accordance with the laws of the state of Nevada, this court. Oh, fuck that bitch! Hey! Oh, 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 hey! Oh, oh, hey! 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 Let me tell y'all about some local news. I hate to do it. Roll Tide. Roll Tide. In Alabama news, we have this man who crashes his car into a pole, strips butt naked, okay? Runs into the Bass Pro Shop. I don't know if you've ever been into uh, one of these Bass Pro Shops that has the aquarium and the fish and they have like the waterfall. Well, he decides he's gonna take a dive, y'all. Not any kind of dive. He gonna cannon a ball off of the rock into the water and take him a nice little swim until the police show up. And then he decides that he is gonna take a leap of faith, I guess, and he leaps out of the aquarium and busts his head and knocks himself unconscious. You can, yes, this is a true story. Yes, this happened, you all. And I'm gonna show you a little bit of the video, but I can't even show you the whole thing because he's butt naked. And I'm not trying to get no strike up in these YouTube streets because they give strikes for nudity, right? So I'll put the link in the box, but I'll show you a little bit. Take a look. Do you think? Yeah, I got that. He did a cannonball. Oh, send me a picture of that. Oh! Y'all, so that's what's going on in Alabama. Mm -mm -mm. It's so sad. It's so sad. So, of course, they arrested him. They had him checked out for mental evaluations and see what's going on up here because they say some ain't right, right? All right. So, let's move on to the to Miami, Florida. Y'all know they got a whole nother group of people down there, too. But uh, Miami alien invasion. Could it be, you all? I always say real life is stranger than fiction. So what's going on? They say that there were four teenagers reportedly that got into a fight. But then you have other people say, no, nah, that ain't what happened. There was something otherworldly that showed up at the Mall of Miami. And I want you to judge for yourself. Listen to what this young man has to say about his experience at the Miami Mall. For uh, the New Year's, you know what I'm saying? Me and my girl, I got a little timeshare. We was down there on a um like a mini vacay, you know, just to start the New Year's off right. So anyway, we had we happened to be at that mall. So um we had Foot Locker or whatever. Next thing you know, you start hearing all this commotion outside, sound like fire like firecrackers or something. So, you know what I'm saying? I you know, I grab her close, I'm like, yo, we about to get up out of here because I you know, I originally thought that they were shooting. You know what I'm saying? I thought, you know, some type of um gunfight had broke out whatever the case is because you know we're not familiar with miami we're not familiar with the city so i'm like damn i ain't even got my blick so you know what i'm saying we about to we about to we about to swerve next thing i know it's like crazy like we just see all these people running like you know uh fat fat 
fat chicks, you know, old ladies, like I'm talking about moving. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, old people even move. I'm talking about moving. So, you know, my girl, she like, what's going on? I'm like, fuck all that. We out. Like, I'm not going to ask no questions. We just going to follow the crowd. Next thing you know, you know, real like gunshots start going off. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, we trying to we trying to follow the follow the crowd. Get out of there. I look back. I look back. No cap, yo. No cap. I look back. It looked like 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 a big ass shadow. But it was solid at the same time, like a few, like a few shadows, but they were solid at the same time. And them, it's, it almost looked like they was coming our direction, like they was chasing us, but they was disappearing and reappearing closer. So I'm like, yo, what? So we start really moving. Next thing you know, we start hearing more gunshots, like these dudes start firing at this shit. Get outside, mad police, all that. You know what I'm saying? They start, the police is like trying to get all the people that ran out the mall. They like trying to like... Um, detain these people, whatever. But you know, me and my girl, we ended up just, you know, s s sliding past all that and everything like that. But you know, a lot of people saying, why didn't nobody film and all that? When that type of shit is going on, you know what I'm saying? Shit like that, like some paranormal, nobody thinking about no phone. You know what I'm saying? Everybody going survival mode. But for real, for real. So. Mm. Now, I would be lying to you all if I didn't say that that haircut itself would give me great suspicion if he was really telling the truth or if he was living in an alter reality. But, you know, it's crazy out here in these streets. So I don't know. What do you think, you all? Is he telling the truth? Okay, y'all. You know, I know it's hard to know what to believe in these internet streets, right? Because with AI, you can make your reality whatever you want it to be. So people can just like copy and paste and do all kinds of strange and weird things and make it look like it really happened. But y'all, I am not beyond believing this. I mean, 2024, y'all better be prayed up, covered in the blood in these streets. You know how people say, who you with? Who you with, big dog? Who you, you best be with Jesus, okay? You best be covered in the blood in these streets because 2024 ain't playing no games, y'all. Exposing everything for they feel. And, now, and these aliens too, exposing. Y'all know it ain't no aliens, right? Just so you know, those really demons, fallen angels. But that's a whole nother story. If they want to call them aliens, we'll let them call them aliens. But y'all better be praying out here in these streets. But! Anyways, that is all the current news that I have for you all this evening. I hope that I brought a smile to your face. I hope I gave you something to think about, entertained you for a little bit on your Friday evening. I love you all to life. And don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And I will see you soon on the next round. All right, guys. I love you to life. Bye.